I've been playing golf for about 50 some odd years. And, uh, you know, my experience in golf, and you know, I played the PGA Tour for 18 years. I played the CN Tour for 18 years. So golf been uh, about 40 years of me in making a living in golf. I think educating our youth to what impact we've had on this game, the Charlie Siffers, Calvin Pete, Lee Elder, uh, Mr. Jim Dent, who, who's with us here today. So from, from, a, from an interest standpoint, I think it's very important to educate them about the sport and the game, not only from a playability and the ability to play and enjoy it and perhaps even become a professional golfer, but there's an entire industry there. There's a billion dollar sector in golf that you wouldn't know about it unless you had an interest or someone educated you about it. So, so not only can we play golf, but perhaps we can become owners one day in, in the industry. Being the first African American in this type of position here at Sand Hill and in our community, in the county, uh, it's a big responsibility of mine to be true to myself and true to my passion, which is growing the game of golf. And by doing that and partnering with ICYG, um, we have a huge responsibility to touch as many youth as we can, as many minorities as we can, and expose them to this great game. Malachi Knowles has grown a game of golf. Jimmy Garvin's grown, grown a game of golf. All these young men and women who are here tonight and their parents are growing a game of golf. It's not an easy sport. You think, you know, you'll see LeBron James Duncan last night in that NBA playoff game and you realize that, you know what, golf may be just as hard as that to do over the course of time. So you're talking about the future of golf. You're talking about a game that's very difficult. People have to buy into it, love it, feel it, make it a way of their life, uh, make it a way their, that they socialize. And uh, you don't have to be on a PGA Tour or the LPGA Tour to be a success story. You need to have a, a good career, be a good person, and if you get a chance to play golf and it makes it part of your social system and your friendships and a lot of stuff that you do, then that's the future of golf.